Hi guys, it's Farmer Mad Mimi with Mad Mimi's Crochet and Farming. And um, I thought that I would do a little update on the goose eggs. Um, we do have two batches of goose eggs. We have four that are on day four today and two that are on day two. And um, it is probably too early to see if the eggs are fertile, but I thought that we would go ahead and try anyway. So I'm going to do the first four um, just to see if they are fertile yet. Um, I'm going to say that we probably won't know for sure until day seven. If they're showing nothing on day seven, then they're not going to be fertile. So, um, I'm going to, it's finally dark outside, and um, I am working on a secret project that only one person knows about. And um, I'm stopping that for the night, and we'll pick that up tomorrow. I just started the project today. And it will be done tomorrow, come hell or high water, I hope. But let me get all of the lights and everything cut out. And um, we'll see if we can see anything in the eggs. So I'll be right back. All right, guys. This is goose egg number one. And we'll see if we can see anything in here. <sighs> see if I can get it. Come on. A little more. I think I'm going to cut this other light off. Hold on one second. That might help some. I'm looking right here. And I'm thinking that that could be a possibility of it being fertile because that's where it starts um, and it's moving with the egg when I turn the egg you will see X's and numbers on it because I was turning them by hand for a little bit. But I think number one could be a possibility. But Persephone has to move. So I'm going on to egg number two now. Okay, Persephone, you need to move. Okay, guys, here's number two. It's kind of hard to write on eggs. So let's see possibility of this one. And yes, I think this one is fertile. Persephone, hold on, let me get Persephone down. Persephone, please stop. No. Okay. Let's see. If you can see right here where my fingers are, that looks like the starting of possibly some veins. Mwah. Yes, I love you, baby girl. But I'm trying to do this. Hold on a second. Persephone, please. If you make me drop an egg, I'm going to have to rip your lips off. Okay, so, so yes, right here, 
I know it is kind of hard to see, but there is some red splotching, which could possibly mean that they are fertile or that this one is fertile. So this one is a possibility too. Yes, thank you, Persephone. All right, so let's look at egg number three. Stop. Okay, guys, here is egg number three. So let's check this one out. This one looks fertile also. It's kind of hard to see, but it's looking like it is right here. Right where my thumbnail is. There's looking like there's some veins starting there. So maybe tomorrow we can see if see better. But I think that one definitely is fertile. So far I think all three of them are because I am seeing a difference in them. And I'm trying to see if it looks like it's moving. It does kind of to me, but I don't know if it's my eyes or not. Okay, on to egg number four. Okay, here we are with egg number four. So let's take a peek at this one. This one, Persephone, you're driving me out of my mind. I'm not sure about this one. Hold on one second. Persephone, you have got to stop. I just gave you some treats, baby girl. Yeah. No. So yes, I am not sure about this one. No, no. All right, you're gonna get ready to have a spanking now because you're not listening. No, no, no. Okay, a little bit of behavior modification for the putty tat. So yes, this one I am not sure about. Trying to get the yoke to follow me. So this one I am unsure of. So we will wait for day seven for sure on this one, but we will try again tomorrow um, since we should be able to start seeing them, but for sure on day seven. So until tomorrow on day five for the first four eggs, and it would be day three for the second two. So, see you guys tomorrow. Ha, 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 ha,